5G is one term that you'd be hearing a lot more in the near future and one of the first devices out there to support the network of the future is already here. Hello guys, Vic Christoph with Phonerini here and the device we're talking about is the new LG V50 ThinQ 5G or as normal people would call it, short and sweet, the LG V50. A 6.4 inch phone with a gorgeous AMOLED screen, a smooth and elegant glass construction with no camera bump and a top tier Snapdragon 855 processor, the V50 is as fast as Android phones get. But how does it compare against an iPhone? And not just any iPhone but the similarly big and powerful iPhone XS Max? Let's compare the two to find out. First of all, in terms of just size, the LG is ever so slightly taller and ever so slightly narrower, plus it's just a hair thicker. Or put in other words, the differences in size between these two really are not that big. And it's clear that we're dealing with two big phones here. It's also nice that we have full IP68 water and dust protection on both of them. One little convenience that the V50 keeps is the 3.5mm headphone jack a feature that is long missing on iPhones. But then the screen sizes are also similar, 6.4 inches on the V50 and 6.5 on the iPhone, with a slightly higher resolution on the LG, but both are of the OLED kind with lively, rich colors. And then there is one other thing too, the notch. The LG has a notch just as big as the one on the iPhone, but it does not have the advanced, secure 3D face recognition that the iPhone has. Now, that might be confusing, because LG's other phone, the LG G8, has such a system in place, but this here V50 actually does not. What it does have inside that notch is an earpiece and two front-facing cameras, a regular and an ultra-wide one for your group selfies. And for security on the V50? Well, you have a good old traditional fingerprint scanner on the back of the phone. The bigger differences between these two, however, is in the way they work. The LG being an Android phone has the openness of the platform, the more plentiful customization options and more, while with the iPhone you have iOS, iMessage and guaranteed timely updates for years to come. We have mentioned customization and there is one brand new way to customize the V50. Not just with anything, but with a second screen. It comes in the form of a rather bulky contraption that reminds us of a folio case on steroids. You get a slightly smaller secondary screen and a hinge between the two displays that can stay at two different angles. It looks like a very early foldable phone prototype and we're not quite sure how we feel about it. There is probably some similar third party case for the iPhone, but nothing made from Apple obviously and this one is made by LG. In terms of cameras, the V50 has three of them on the back. The regular one, the tele one and the ultra wide one. While the iPhone only has the regular and the telephoto but not the ultra wide one. And the V50 also has the bigger battery, a 4000 mAh cell against a nearly 3200 mAh battery on the iPhone. Plus you get double the storage on the base model, with 128 gigs on the LG versus just 64 gigs on the base iPhone XS model and of course you can get pricier iPhones with more storage. Now all in all the V50 looks a lot more like an upgraded and refined V40 rather than a truly novel device. The V50 is also not a phone that you can buy right now. It will first go on sale on Sprint only after the carrier launches its 5G network sometime by the end of the first half of the year. And with that, it will certainly beat the iPhone to the punch because the iPhone simply does not have 5G. And if you want to be among the first to try the speedy network, you should definitely wait for the V50. But for all others, Phones like the iPhone XS Max or even the new Galaxies are devices you can buy right now and that might be their key advantage. Thank you so much for watching this video guys, subscribe if you want to see more from us, hit that thumbs up button if you like the video and I will talk to you in the next one.